Hi everybody, this is Mirav and today I'm going to teach you how to add a zone to your iJuma ad agency component. You have two options here, you can either click on zones on the left here under managers or you can click on zone on the zone button here. And now you can just click, you, you see that you already have a few zones but if you want to add a new one you just click new. And we'll go over all the options here. When you uh, enter a title, make sure that it's something very descriptive. I just like to call it the name of the position, the module position that it's going to be on. For example, if I put it on the left, I'll just call it left zone, or if I put it on the right, I'll call it right zone. So let's say that I want to put it on the right zone. So I'm going to call it right zone. Now, how do you know which module positions are available for the zone? We made it really easy for you. All you have to do is click this link over here, preview zones. And now that you can see all the yellow areas with the red text in them, these are the zones that are available for you. So you have breadcrumbs here, you have user 5, user 4, and login, and all those areas are available for you. So choose the one that you want to use. So for example, we're going to choose right. Now, do you want it published? Yes. Do you want to show the title? Probably not. You don't want to show the title because it's just going to say right zone. But if you want to call it like advertisement instead, you can do that as well. Now, here's the cool thing that we just added recently. You can choose how many rows and how many columns of ads you want to display. By default, it's one row and one column, which means one ad. But we can also make it three rows and two columns, which is a total of six ads. And if we choose that, it's going to show uh, this way on the front end. You see, this is an example where we have two columns and three rows. Or you can make it one row and four columns, or one row and two columns, whatever you want, basically. It's very flexible. And here you can choose if you want to rotate the banners, which means the banners are going to start rotating uh, spontaneously without having to refresh the page, uh, which is really good for you because you're going to get more impressions and people usually pay you for impressions. Here you can choose how many uh, milliseconds uh, between uh, rotations. Uh, 10,000 milliseconds uh, means uh, 10 seconds, but you can change it to any number you want. Don't make it too fast because it's going to make people dizzy, you know, so make it at least five seconds. Here you can choose the randomize if you can, if you want to randomize the banners or if you want them to show uh, by the order of uh, appearance in the banner manager, which is here, the ad manager. And here, show advertise here link, which means if you want to show a link at the bottom of the zone or at the top of the zone, that says advertise here. So here as you can see uh, I've chosen to show it at the bottom of the zone but you can also show it at the top or both. You can see it says you have four different options not to show it at all, show it at the bottom, show it at the top and show it at the bottom or the top. And also you can choose where you want this link to take people. So right now it's, it's an overview which means it's going to take them to the overview page by default. But you can also change it to the registration immediately to the advertisement, uh, advertiser registration or to a specific URL or to an overview page. Okay, so let's take a look at the bottom. Uh, there's nothing here that you need to set, but this is a very useful thing for you for the future in case you want to show ads from this zone on a different site. All you have to do is copy this code and place it on a different site wherever you want or you can install our special module and use uh, and enter these parameters over there and that will also uh, that that's only for the Joomla sites so this is if you don't have a Joomla site and you want to display it there and this is if you have a separate Joomla site that you want to display there you would use these parameters here in order to display those ads 
Here on the right, just like any other module, all of our zones are also modules. You can cho choose to uh, on which pages you want to display uh, the zone, right? Just like any other module. So right now I'm choosing all, and I click save, and I'm done. So this is it about how to add a new zone for your Arjuna Ad Agency. Thanks for watching.